It's in the kitchen with Dana, and today I want to walk you through how to cook pignoli nuts in the microwave. We're going to toast them actually. Here's what I decided. I cook popcorn inside of a brown bag. So, looking at popcorn as a kernel, and while this may not be a kernel, it certainly does look like familiar territory, I decided that I was going to try to use the same premises of cooking, that I cook popcorn in a brown bag and it pops really nice. So we're gonna go ahead and try with pinoli nuts. Knowing that these are something that I really don't wanna mess up, I thought, do I put oil on them? And then I said, no, that would be disastrous. And I tried it and that was disastrous. But I did find that a little bit of water with um, rinsing and then draining and adding salt and plumping it in the bag and then throwing about a half cup to three quarters of a cup into the microwave, you will actually get toasted pignoli nuts and I will show you how it's done. So I've gone ahead and put the half cup to three quarters cup of pignoli nut in this sieve and I'm going to go ahead and just quickly rinse them, just like so. Now I know they have a little bit of a moisture content to them, which should help me with the non-burning factor while it's in the microwave, which was what I was a little bit spazzy about. And I'm gonna go ahead and coat them with some salt so that they're gonna have a little taste. And now simply I'm going to add them into my brown bag. It's just a regular lunch bag that I send my kids lunch in each day. You can see I'm leaving all the water behind. Now let's travel to the microwave. There I placed the bag in the microwave. You can see it's folded over. So now we're going to take them out of the microwave. And just so you can see that I'm not going to do any editing, they are nice and dry and they are toasted. I can smell them from here and they're sizzling. So yes indeed, these are toasted. You can see there is no moisture on them and you can tell that they were toasted because some of these are actually a darker color. So I ended up with giving them a minute and 15 seconds. Sometimes it is only about a minute, sometimes it's 45 seconds. It really depends on your microwave. So you can cook pignoli nuts toast them actually in your microwave. It's simple, it is a water soak real quick, lightly salting, draining, straining, putting in a paper bag and going to the microwave. And with up to about a minute and a half, you will have your toasted pine nuts depending on your microwave. This is In the Kitchen with Dana, toasting pignoli nuts. This is a great shortcut. Join me for other recipes at danavento.com.